Putt chip is the easiest shot that you can hit from around the greens. You basically are putting with more loft. I have an 8 iron here. As you can see, my handle is, is on the inside of my left thigh, but I, with my ball position being more in the middle of my stance here, I have more shaft lean. The hands are pretty much going to be right here on the inside of your left thigh on every shot you hit, except a flop. So as you can see, I've got a little more weight in my left foot, and uh, my shaft is leaning more forward. So now as we watch me hit this shot, you can see the club swing back, and when I come in and get to impact, I'm going to have the handle a little more forward than I did at address. So you're going to see this shaft leaning a little more forward. I'm going to hit down and through, and then I'm going to let the club head release a little bit past my hands there. Okay? Three things different than putting. I already said two of them. One is we have more shaft lean and the ball is positioned in the middle of our stance or more back. And then lastly, on purpose, we're going to play this off the toe of the club because off the toe of the club, it is uh, going to come off dead and the ball will not be as hot as hitting it in the sweet spot. Now a variation of this setup is setting up with the ball more back in your stance, okay? So now we have even more shaft lean and we've de-lofted the club a little bit, but in a sense you can think of this sh shot now as your bump and run, okay? So this is the bump and run, the variation, very simply putting the ball more back in your stance when you put a ball more back in your stance and deal off the club, the ball's going to come off lower, hotter, and run further. So this is a good shot to play from the middle of your stance, and when you play it in the back of your stance, you can simply call it a bump and run. You can use anything from a 7-iron to a sand wedge with this shot, and the reason I use an 8-iron is because an 8-iron in the middle of your stance is going to be about the same feel for the distance as your putter. So as you can see here on the right, I have my putter and you can see that the shaft angle is at 68 degrees. Here it is with a pitching wedge and you can see that I'm at 67 degrees. So it's pretty much the same angle or lie angle that you're gonna have with a putter. Now, being that a pitching wedge or an 8-iron is longer than a putter, this heel of the club might be a little bit off the ground, but as you can see, I'm playing the ball off the toe of the club. So, this is just simply straight back and straight through. No tricks here. And it's a very simple and effective shot to play. I hope this shot helps your game. For more information, please visit my website, LarryRinker.com. I think you're going to chip a lot of shots in with this putt chip.